Hello everyone, welcome back to Code with this channel. In this video, we will just upload a file using Node.js. Okay, we will use the multi library to upload the file, and for the front end, we will use React.js because we need to create an input field. So, after selecting a file, we will upload that using Node.js and we will store that inside our app. Okay, the, the best way that I should show you how to store your file and how to upload it. This is the multi library okay that we will use to upload a file so first we need to install it in our server side app okay here we, i have created two apps one for Re one is the react app and the second one is the server we want to implement our Re node.js app okay to use multiple in node.js and to upload the file but the uh, i have created just the react app to show and to create an input fields and in the browser to select a file uh, in this server side app, I have just created, uh, um, I have installed Multer. Let's check it. Yeah, this is the Multer which I have already installed. If you didn't, just copy this and install, install it inside your uh, Node app. After installing it, so now let's first of all, we will create an input field to select a file. So this is an input field and this is a file with us. Uh, Unchanged, whenever we change it, for example, we select a file, we should store it somewhere. So to store it, let's create a state variable here. State file. Is equal to use state hook. And here I will just sit uh, this file which I have selected inside this file variable state variable. So to sit that, I will just use this arrow function. And I will call sit file method and I will write e dot target dot uh, files zero okay the first one so after storing it inside that variable now let's create a button whenever we press the button we should upload that file Okay, by clicking this on click, we should call upload. For example, upload function. Okay, let's create that. So here now we will uh, just upload this file. Okay, to our Node.js, our uh, Node app. So to upload that, I will use Axis library to which is HTTP request and response library. Let's import first of all that. Axis, they have already installed Axis. Axis dot post. And after that, I will specify the URL. Okay, what is our URL? Our URL is HTTP localhost. Yeah, HTTP, we should write it in string. After that, the port number, our server side port would be 3001. I will show you it later. And after that, the route that would be upload, for example. Okay, we will upload this API, upload API. We will create it later. And then we will specify our image here. Okay, so to specify the image to upload the file, we will just use forum data object. Const forum data is equal to new forum data. <coughs> so here forum data data paint like file then file okay now let's pass this uh, um, forum data after that we will get a result so I will leave it empty dot cage we will get an error I'll get a response if that empty right now so whenever we pass this so now we will move to our server side app let's move to our server side app this is our server side app and this is the index file where we will write our code okay this is alert which i have imported express which is a framework to write our code and cars which is used to um, for the to access our server side in the front end and then we created an app and then we use those cards and also this express JSON, which is used to uh, uh, 
transfer our data which we are passing from frontend to the JSON format. And here we run our app. So now let's create that API, that upload API. Okay, this one, upload API. Cons, uh, so let's use app.post upload. This is our API. And we will get a request and response. Let's create that. So to use Multer, okay, to get our app and store that somewhere else. So I will store my image inside this public, and here I will create one another folder by the name of images. I will store my image inside this images. Okay, to store that I will use Multer now. So to um, upload uh, to import a uh, Multer, I will write const Multer is is equal to require multer after that i will use it now so first of all i will just specify the storage okay storage is equal to multer dot disk storage inside this i will just specify two um, uh, options two we have two options here to use okay the first one is we will specify the destination where we want to store our image destination and here we will get uh, create a function now inside the uh, function we have three properties the first one is the request okay the request that we are passing okay this request then we have the file okay the file which we have uploaded in the th third one is cb callback function so now we will just create let's return this callback function okay inside this callback function the first one is the error with as if there for example the user is not like in a someone somewhat else so right now we don't have any error we don't want to handle that and after that the destination where you want to store your image here we will specify just the path so let's specify that that is public with as slash images the second option with us is the file name again we will like access those three things again first is the error we will write null for that and the second one is to specify the name okay the file name a string so to specify the name we will append a date okay with every um, file that we are uploading we will write something like this okay let's just write date dot now this method then a slash um, and after that we will just append now the file dot original name just write something like we should close it here and then I will start it again yeah now we try slash and again here I will just write file dot original name so it is the name of our file then I will show you okay how it looks like after that we will use the multer middleware just come here I will use that let's write const upload i will name it upload is equal to multer and here i will specify the storage 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 and we can just try storage because both are the same after that i will whenever we come to this route we will call this middleware okay to call that i will write just like upload dot single it means the single means that we can upload we will upload just a single file if you want to upload more than one then we can specify array or fields okay that is an array but right now we want to upload just a single one and here we will specify the name of file what was the name of our file that was this file okay we'll just name it file So now let's console dot log request dot body and console dot log request dot file. Let's check it now what happened. Okay, 
and just come here and we will just let's run our boot off front end and server side cd client first of all npm run view first of all i will run this uh, front end up let's move to this url yeah we run that and let's run our server side up cd server npm start service running is running okay so now just let's come here and we will just specify a file like image let's press the upload button let's check it see we got this okay this is the path and file name and destination and let's check yeah the image has uploaded here see this is the image that we have uploaded right now in this uh, image folder but uh, what we do if you want to store it inside the database so for that we will just store um, this path okay this one this path file name we will store this file name inside our database then we will retrieve it back and display through the url okay so it was all about uploading a file using multor in node.js i hope this video was helpful for you if you like this video don't forget to subscribe our youtube channel and thanks for watching